Hey guys, Tonic here. Another Tuesday, another Atomic Shop review. This week in the Atomic Shop, they just released the Shelter's mainframe bundle. I just picked it up, so let's go check it out. So the biggest item in this bundle is going to be this mainframe set. Now there's nine different variations, and they don't actually need power to light up. And I gotta say, they look phenomenal. And another really cool thing that I was doing with this is that they actually snap together. So like if I place this corner piece, they'll snap to it and just create a nice seamless computer area. And I gotta say, it actually is really cool and I can't wait to mess around with this one. And now over in stash boxes, it does come with a brand new vault Tech locker stash box. And it's pretty cool because it actually snaps together to again just create a nice seamless little prop. And this would be great for decorating. I actually really do like this stash box. So next up, this bundle comes with two brand new lamps. So first up, we have a Hollywood floor light, which generates a lot of light. Wow, that thing's like a spotlight. That'll be super cool for if you're trying to make like a little photo mode studio. That is a lot of light. And then over here, we also have the tree lamp, which I am actually very fond of this. This is a super nice lamp. This light, though, I can't get over how bright it is. That is insane how bright this is. One more lamp in this set, which is the Nixie tube wall lamp. And due to the no snapping in the shelters, I can just kind of float it up so we can take a full 360 look at it. And overall, it's, it's all right. It doesn't generate a whole lot of light. It's not very bright, it doesn't stand out a whole lot, but it is very sleek and it had, does have that 50 style with these Nixie tubes. I, I really like it. This lamp set is actually very solid. All right, and there are actually a ton of different carpets included with this bundle. I thought that there were only three like in the preview pictures, but there's actually seven. So there is gonna be this one right here, this pretty nice purple one, which I actually like, this weird looking one. This one I actually kind of like, it's very, like Aztec and Mayan looking. And then this one is all right. Comes with this one, which is very cool. It looks like the old like Chuck E. Cheese carpets. It's, it's kind of cool. And then over here is just some weird modern abstract painting type carpet. But there are a ton of carpets for this bundle. I am actually genuinely impressed with that. And last but not least, there is a wall mounted fan. And I actually, I don't know how to feel about this. I kind of wish it was clean because everything else in these vaults is remarkably clean for the wasteland and this is just filthy but it doesn't look bad it's got a normal fan animation i'm i'm not the biggest fan of this item but still pretty cool to have a wall fan all right and now the atomic shop for those that work and just cannot get on right now on the first page is still the shelter stuff with the mainframe bundle this week over in shelters we have lunch boxes which i was not able to touch into last week not to go on a huge rant or anything but i don't necessarily like them being in the atomic shop as you are paying real money for an xp boost as well as a random buff for an hour sort of pay to win it's sort of right on that line where it's not too much of an advantage over other people but there still is something there so that's just something i'm not the biggest fan of the vault catwalk bundle i am again not the biggest fan of because these catwalks are so buggy they're horrible at snapping to themselves and to my knowledge right now they're still not fixed Going down, we have some other stuff from the catwalk bundle, like the shelf is actually pretty cool, the light set's alright, and the signs and the tree are also pretty cool. Over in Greatest Hits, we have a whole lot of old bundles back, and out of these bundles, if you were to try and pick one, I would recommend the Western Bar Bundle or the Slocum's Joe Bundle. They are super, super cool. However, the Future Tech does have this really cool globe. It spins and shows you where the nukes hits. It is actually really sweet. And then over in Vaulting Leaving Soon, we have some pretty decent stuff. The Red Rocket Diner set is phenomenal. If you don't have that, I would recommend getting that. And over in Special, they brought back some holiday stuff. And now, I really, really wish they made a new holiday bundle as it is getting very close to Christmas and I would love to decorate my camps. For Halloween, they surprisingly went very all out and gave us like four straight Halloween bundles during the month. And so far in this month, we haven't got any Christmas things. And I would argue Christmas is a bigger holiday than Halloween. So here's to hoping to next week. I really do hope that we get some holiday stuff soon. As far as my thoughts and if I'd recommend it, I honestly don't know. The mainframe set with the computer parts is super cool. The lamps are super cool, but everything else felt pretty underwhelming. And I felt like it really just needed one more thing to push it over the top and to really make you go out there and get it. Because as it stands right now, I would honestly just recommend to go and get those computer parts and the lamp from the Atomic Shop separately. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I really do appreciate it. And something I haven't really done before, I actually want to give a huge shout out to the channel members, KN, Deathan Gaming, Christy Mel, and Schwitz. 
thank you guys so much for becoming channel members. I really, really do appreciate it. That is awesome. All that money goes right back into these Atomic Shop reviews so everyone can get a general sense of what the items are and how they actually do look in game. So huge shout out to you guys. Thank you again so much and have a good week, everybody.